Welcome back, gang, for the first time and hopefully many more to come. Don't forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel and click on the notifications right here, this little bell, so you can get those emails every time we go live. Peace. It's the Boxing Voice with Johnny Nelson. How's it going, Johnny? I'm good, I'm good. What a nice turnout it was here in Liverpool uh, for the... Uh, Fight week first press conference for both guys are head to head and whatnot. Be the first time this week. Obviously, they'll have a open workout on Wednesday. Prep final press conference on Thursday. Obviously, the third uh, weigh in on Friday. Ben, and it's fight night, so it's pretty good. You look like you're enjoying yourself as well over there. Of course, every shuffles. time. You know, it's funny because both guys, I think it played it well. I think uh, Tony was cool, uh, his comedic self. Uh, I think uh, David was trying to stay as cool as possible. He knew what to expect when he came up here. So, this to me is. I think will be better than the last fight. The last fight we had excitement, but I think this will be better than the last fight. So do you think, I mean, ultimate question was, uh, did he get under his skin? Do you think he was yeah, yeah, trying he to does. hold it back? Yeah, yeah, without a doubt. Without a doubt. Without a doubt. I mean, if you know David, yeah, without a doubt. And it, that's, a, that's a big piece of humble pie to swallow there. But uh, that's what he does. He'll swallow it because he knows uh, he's done his work, so he's got to think, right, I've got to see what happens Saturday night. I mean, ultimately, if um, if David Hay does come out victorious on Saturday night, uh, do you think it will lead into another another fight with uh, Tony Bellew? Would he Depend close the chapter do. on that? Could do. Could do. Depends how the fight is. Could do. Depends on how the fight is. But I know both fighters. I'd be very surprised if they fought again because I know. But I think this will be a more conclusive finish, uh, and so therefore we'll probably not need that answer. And ultimately, do you think it's going to end in a, in a KO? Do you think I don't think it's going to go the distance. I don't think it goes past the distance. Uh, it goes the distance. Uh, so either way, I think it's going to be a, a, a good fight. Yeah. And how difficult do you reckon it is for a Dave Caldwell being in both? I mean, he was once part of... Nah, it's not difficult at all. Dave's a very professional what he does, gets the job done. Tony's his boy, Tony's his man. And then that's what the job is. And uh, as a trainer, that's what you've got to be able to do, is invest his heart and soul into 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 Tony so uh, I don't think it's gonna be an issue at all. The issue is for, for David because David knows that what what Dave Dave Hay knows what uh, Dave Caldwell knows uh, training camp is like so he has the inside track. Good stuff and uh, prediction then what do you think? I think it's gonna be a stoppage. Uh, it's hard to say who wins and who doesn't win because I think at this stage in their career, I think technically Tony's a better fighter at this stage. I think an on-point David Hay is probably the best. Is the better explosive? Uh, no, Tony's the better boxer at this stage. So at this stage, I expect, I expect Tony to be able to outbox David Hay. At this stage, I think if David can turn back time and produce the career best that we haven't seen for eight years, at least, he's a, he's a better explosive fighter. So if, on, if it's down to boxing, I'd say David. I'd say, uh, I'd say uh, Tony Bellew. If it's down to explosiveness, getting that one shot off, that one shot that David's been very good at, it's down to David. But it's the case of what is what David's capable of doing in this fight because we haven't seen it for quite a while. And just, just finally, I promise this is the last one. Um, if David Hay does win, I mean, how does that change the heavyweight landscape? Do you think he's right? Of course, so, no, no, it'll, it'll be exciting here in the UK because obviously, you know, they, then they'll be thinking Anthony Joshua, that's what he'll be thinking. Uh, and that's a, a fight you could see. Uh, Tony Bellew wins, he's not going to fight Anthony Joshua. Uh, and believe me, I think outside, I think it's a toss up between which one's the biggest UK fight Anthony Joshua and David Hay or Anthony Joshua and uh, Tyson Fury. So it'll be exciting. Good stuff, all the best Thank and uh, thanks once again Johnny. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers.